What is up, Star Wars fans? This is Darth Watts, and in this video, I will be discussing Colin Trevorrow's. I'll be discussing all of Colin Trevorrow's original ideas for Star Wars Episode Nine, which, in case, which I'm sure a lot of you know by now that Colin Trevorrow was fired and that J.J. Abrams took over. Of course, I'll. Uh, of course, all of you know that by now, but I'm going to be discussing all of Colin Terraro's original ideas for Star Wars Episode 9 and what was in his first, what was in his two original scripts for Star Wars Episode 9. The second original script was right after Carrie Fisher died, which Disney rejected because they said it was too dark and there was too much killings in there. So, um, so first off, Colin Trevorrow wanted to have Luke, Snoke, and Leia have a huge role in Episode Nine. He wanted to have a huge, all of them to have a huge role in Episode Nine. Um, he wanted them to have a big part because he wanted to do something very special with them. But after Ryan Johnson, um, after Ryan, after he found out that Ryan Johnson's gonna kill him off, he went back and changed the script for Star Wars Episode Nine. Like he went back and changed it to where um, to where Luke had the same amount of role. Like he still had a big role just as a Force ghost, and that Leia. And this could be spoilers for Star Wars Episode 9. Because Leia, Carrie Fisher's brought back an unused footage. So this could be spoilers for Star Wars Episode 9. Leia, um, Le Leia has a huge, has a huge role. She has a, a huge role. And at the very end, there, there was supposed to be a moment with Leia and Ben Solo. And he was also, but and he also changed the script to where um, Snoke was going to be resurrected instead of keeping Snoke alive. He was going to have Snoke resurrected. He was going to do something special with Snoke, Leia, and Kylo Ren. Um, Leia bilocates at the very end of Colin Trevorrow's original script. Convinces not only Leia but Anakin's Force Ghost is involved too. They convince him to turn back to the light, and then after Leia and Anakin's Force Ghost convince him to turn back to light, he ends up does, but Leia ends up dying. You know how in Return of the Jedi, the son redeems his father Darth Vader, Luke redeems his father Darth Vader, but Darth Vader dies. Leia turns Kylo Ren back to the light. And Leia dies. So it's kind of the other way around. That was his first. That was his second. That that was his. That was his first. In his first official original script for Star Wars Episode Nine. Now the second one, Ray was Leia was supposed to die at the beginning of the movie. Like they don't show Leia on screen. They just show the ship that she was on, and then she ends up dying with Finn Poe. Right in the resistance, and then a bunch of killings, and then the, and then Disney ended up rejecting that because it was too dark of a film, and they ended up firing Colin Trevorrow. He was already having a lot of struggles due to Carrie Fisher's death, Ryan Johnson killing off Snoke, which he was going to have Snoke resurrect himself, which that wasn't a big deal for him. But but ma the main part is. Uh, Carrie Fisher's death what gave him the most struggles on rewrites for Star Wars Episode 9. But, hey, that's all That's all I have to say about what Colin Trevorrow's original ideas for Star Wars Episode 9. I've explained them all to you. Um, be sure to like, subscribe, comment, and don't forget to check out Topedo. Uh, because... He needs more views. But, um... That's all I have for this video. Like, subscribe, comment. I'll see you guys later in another video.